So the trailer had a break in a nice covered garage for a couple of weeks and I had a good break for a couple of weeks. So I am checking the trailer. I'm making sure that there are enough air in the tires. My tires are a little low. I checked them with my tire pressure monitoring system that I have in the truck. So I love that thing. It's super easy to check the um, tire pressure. And so I have this portable air compressor that I got off of Amazon and I absolutely love this thing. So these tires have a, a sensor in them that can be linked to a tire pressure monitoring system. And that's what I have in the truck and it says 61 so I and on cold, like I haven't run the tires. I wanna put a little air in the tires to get it up to 65 PSI. This one's charged, put that in there. <laughs> it's already set at 65 PSI on here from when I used it previously. So all you have to do is set it here. Then it automatically shuts off when it hits 65 PSI, which is awesome. And don't lose your lid. I'm gonna do the other tire. Cold tire pressure, 65, which it should be. Perfect. We've got a bunch of bugs on the trailer, so I'm gonna rinse it off here in the car wash. Plenty of clearance. clean I got most of the bugs off and it fit right in and right out to um, the Spokane Coeur d'Alene area because that's where a lot of my friends and family are. And so um, I just wanted to update you in the middle of this video because I didn't get any footage of me parking the trailer over there. I just parked the trailer in my family's backyard right in the middle of everyone so I could just go and drive and see everyone. I got access to 30 um, amp power which was perfect because it was super hot um, and like 100 degrees outside so it was perfect to be able to run the air conditioner and then um, yeah so I didn't get any footage you know just because I was just sitting in somebody's yard you know with the trailer and I'm I was really just going out and visiting family I just wanted to update in the middle of the video that I didn't get any footage over there but I did on my way back to Montana after visiting all of my friends and family for a couple of weeks over there I did go to the KOA in Newport Washington on my way back to Montana so here's some footage of that <laughs> just backed into the spot at the KOA in Newport, Washington. Site 329, we got water, power, and we have sewer. So when I pulled in, I needed to level it out from side to side, so I had to put this side up just a little bit, messed around with it a little bit, and finally got it level, um, <laughs> finally got it level enough and this also showed it was level enough.
got this master python lock and it works really good for the surge protector. Power with the lock. cooking up a ribeye steak. but the bees immediately attacked me for this. Yeah, check it out. Mm -hmm. 